Hey what's going on guys welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to be showing you an awesome squad builder on FIFA 16. So as you can see it's in a 4-3-2-1 formation and it's like a Serie A slash uh, La Liga hybrid. Really good team. Uh, I used to actually have this exact team um, and it won me loads of games in Division 1 um, and has always been very good for me. So uh, this team costs around 58 and a half K on PS4 and around 39 K on Xbox One. So I'm going to say it's, on average it's about 50 K this team. So you know it, it's not very expensive actually. Uh, if you have the coins definitely try and pick it up um, and I'll run you through the team quickly. So as you can see in goal I have got Booth on. He's basically just you know your standard Serie A goalkeeper. The one that I go to every time when I'm making a Serie A team. Really solid you know really good all round stats. Definitely a player you should try and pick up. Um, obviously if you can afford him but I think he's pretty cheap anyway so you should be able to uh, moving on to centre backs I have Chiellini and Matur really good defenders you know they're very both they're both very fast uh, really good defending and physical stats I mean Chiellini stats you know they're amazing uh, with that 90 defending and 84 physical um, it's re really good play you know an absolute rock at the back and similar with Matur actually as well He's a very fast player um, and also very solid in defence. He's also got, he's got a high medium work rate though, um, so he does sort of get forward a little bit sometimes. But you know that's not really a problem to be honest. You know it's not like he's making runs up up the pitch. You know to be in a striker position or anything like that. But yeah, in general, really good defenders. Um, and then as for my right back, Danny Alves, as you can see, very good defending um, and very fast player as well. He's got that high-low work rate though, which is a bit of a problem, but I just find that if I put the player instruction to tell him to stay back while attacking on this card, you know, he'll just stay at that right bit, right back position and just keep the defence solid, basically. Same with Alexandro on the left side, you know, he's got a high attacking work rate as well. But just stick a uh, stay back while attacking player instruction on him and uh, and he'll do a good job at left back, he'll stay back. Um, he's also got really good stats, as you can see, uh, really nice all-rounded stats. I think his lowest stat is his shooting, which is 65, which is pretty good. Um, and then moving on to my centre midfielders, you know, really good, really good centre midfielders. They're not the tallest of players, um, I will admit, but, you know, really good players nevertheless. Um, they're all very fast, which is useful, you know, um, so they can all catch up with the other team, you know, nip in to make tackles and everything. Boya Valero in centre mid, uh, really good player. His, his stats feel a lot better than what they say on his card, actually. You know, he feels a lot, a lot better at defending than 65 and a lot stronger than 67. Um, he feels a lot like Nine Golden, and I'd compare him to, um, having used them both in the same team before. They feel very, they feel like very similar players in my opinion. Then we have Iniesta on that right side. Uh, you probably all used him before, you know. For his stats, he's really cheap, and in game, he's just amazing. This guy, his long shots, uh, his passing, his dribbling, even his defending. You know, he just manages to nip in front of players and, and nick the ball off them um, nine times out of ten, which is really useful. And then on the left side we have got Marquisio, uh, you know, you've probably all used this guy. He's got really good all-round stats as you can see, a really solid centre midfielder. He just, you know, runs the game um, up and down the pitch all match. Really good player, definitely try and pick him up. And then as for my strike force, as you can see it is very sweaty. We have got Morata, who's pretty, he's probably one of the tallest players in the team excluding the centre-backs. Uh, he's about 6'1 six, six or 6'2 I think. But you know, he's very fast as well, he's also got an awesome shot on this guy. Um, you know, really good striker all round. Uh, we'll get you loads of goals if you stick this guy up top. And then left forward and right forward, we have got Insignia and Williams, as you can see here. Insignia is a little bit slower, you know, with the 89 pace, but he makes up for it with his dribbling with 88. Very good on the ball. Um, and also got really good passing and shooting as well. Um, and then as for Williams, he's more like a powerhouse, this guy, you know, 93 pace, absolutely rapid. And then he's also got that 81 physical, so he can basically just play through any defence um, and tear them out, tear them open, basically, um, and get you loads of goals. So yeah, that's the team, guys. Uh, remember to leave a like if you enjoyed, subscribe if you're new around here, and I will see you in the next video.